Hi guys, I'm Pete from Precision. How are you guys going? Happy end of financial year sale if you guys are in business. All right gang, one of the biggest questions that we get asked these days, lately particularly, is uh, if you're running a machine with Windows 7 or Windows 8, how do I disable those pesky Windows 10 upgrades? Now firstly, let me say this, if you have a machine that is capable of running Windows 10 that's compatible, I would encourage that you go ahead and do the upgrade. Now come the 29th of July, apparently the Windows 10 upgrade is pretty much going to be forced on everybody through the normal Windows updates. Now, if you don't want this to happen for whatever reason, and like I said, I would encourage you to do the Windows 10 upgrades. If you're not sure if your computer is already compatible for Windows 10, uh, the upgrade when it begins to install will actually tell you that. So the very, very first thing that it'll do when you do the Windows 10 update uh, will be it'll run a compatibility check with your machine. So if it says that your machine's uh, compatible, then it's a pretty good chance it is. However, this is all about those of you out there that want to live in the Stone Age and don't want to do the Windows 10 upgrade. Now, it's quite simple to actually disable it. There's a very simple uh, third-party app out there. It's really easy to use, runs very low on system resources, and uh, it's just... It's just simple. So once you install this, it will disable Windows 10 and stop Windows 10 from ever hassling you again to do the upgrade. Just remember that after the 29th of July, the free upgrade finishes. So if you want to upgrade after that date, it will then cost you $149 for Windows 10 Home and $279 for Windows 10 Pro. Okay, let's get on with it. Let's show you how to disable Windows 10 upgrades. All right, let's go. Okay guys, first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to Mr. Google, because Mr. Google is God. And we're going to type in Never 10, and I'm going to hit that. And uh, pretty much the very first one that comes up is uh, grc.com, and that's where you want to go. Never 10, grc.com. We're going to click on that. And there it is, fantastic. And that's exactly what we need. It's just a tiny little app. Down here, we're going to click on the download now. We're going to click on run when that pops up down here. Now, I'm assuming you've got a Windows-based machine, otherwise you wouldn't be looking for a Never 10, would you? Okay. You're going to click on yes. And there you go. Now, this pops up. Now, this is how simple this little piece of kit is to use. I'm just going to close this window. <clears throat> this pops up now. It's just like a little app. Disable Windows 10 upgrade. Click on that, beautiful, and that's it. So you can disable it or you can enable it at any stage down the track if you decide that you want the Windows 10 upgrade. All right, click on that, click exit, and voila, you are done, as simple as that. How easy was that, guys? Okay, guys, so there you go. I hope that that's helped you out. Now, remember, like I said, now I would encourage you to do the Windows 10 upgrade if your machine is compatible. But, hey, if you don't want it and you like your Windows 7 or your Windows 8, you can stick with it by that simple little trick that I just showed you. And don't forget uh, to check us out at precisioncomputers.com.au and uh, check us out on our Facebook page as well. Okay, love you again. Happy end of financial year sale. <laughs> Happy end of financial year. All right, 1st of July, a brand spanking new year is ahead of us. All right, love you guys. See ya. Here's my hair, is my hair all right? <laughs>